Hi, this is Nick Callett, founder of Deckable. And Cindy asked me to put together a little short video to show you um, what Deckable is, and also for you guys, importantly, how easy it is to import your deck. So um, here's the Fit, Fierce, and Fun deck in Deckable. And this is basically an app of uh, exploring all the card decks you love on your phone or your tablet. And so I can open up the deck. There's loaded the cards for me. I can shuffle the cards, and it's really simple. And it feels really tactile, right? To see your card deck being played with like that. I can flip it over and then shuffle my deck on the other side too, right? It's upside down, it's whatever, whatever you want. It's easy. And now I can just uh, pick a couple of cards and I can pop those onto my playing surface, right? And I can literally, you know, organize these any which way I want. I can flip that over if I want. Uh, I can journal. I can even uh, talk to my phone. This is what I'm feeling. There we go. It's recorded my timeline away. There's my event in the timeline. There's my journal entry. It's saved away, nice and simple. And, and I can basically browse my timeline and, and I can click on you know, each different experience that I've had with different cards that I've played with each different day. Right? And these are all the different decks that are on Deckable, right? So. There's a tarot spread, et cetera, et cetera. Right? So it's super simple to do. So let's now jump over to have a look at that process in Deckable, right? How do we actually import that deck? It's really, really simple. Okay. So here I've created just started creating a new deck in Deckable and I've just given it a name and I've given it uh, the author's name as well. I create that deck. The second I create it, it drops me into the um, import screen, right? And what it does, it wants me to import, uh, give me a CSV, which is just a, a form of a spreadsheet um, with the names of the cards and the files of the, the artwork files, right? Well, I've got all that stuff already created here. So there's my back of box, uh, front of box. Here's the cards. You can see different cards there. Uh, this all came from the PDF that came from Cindy. There's the shared back. Uh, nice and simple. So what I'm going to do, first off, is grab all of these cards because I need the file names. And I'm just going to uh, right click and copy those file names. And if I copy just the file names, what it tends to do is to actually copy the images. And I just want to um, just grab the file name. So I jump over to a text editor and I edit and paste a match style, not paste. Paste would paste in the images, paste and match style, just paste in the file names. And there we are, right? So I've got my file names. And now what I want to do is to create uh, my spreadsheet. So I take a copy of, uh, take the master template and I make a copy. And then this is uh, Cindy demo. Okay, so there is my new version of the spreadsheet. Close down that one. And in the spreadsheet, there's basically tool tips that explains everything to you. You can see things color code green and red if you manage to do things correctly, it goes green. And if you uh, do it incorrectly, it goes um, red. Yeah, so here I've got the file names. So I'm just gonna grab those. And this is the first face of my card deck. So I put it in there and they all passed, right? Because they're all JPEGs, that's all correct file names. Um, if you have multiple faces in your deck, you can actually just put each of these into the different columns. It's nice and simple. I just want to put in, um, this is that, great. So I'm going to put that, I don't want these. There we go. So then here's my, Here's my spreadsheet with uh, cards one to 33 with the file names correctly loaded. If I wanna put in a description, I've got a description column here. If you have suits in your deck, uh, there's a tags column, so you can use that for suits. It's, it's simple and easy. Uh, so let's now jump on over, because I nearly just, I just need to make it, uh, I need to just download this as a CSV, okay? And it's going to save Cindy demo CSV to my computer. And here I am on the deck, and I just, uh, in fact, yeah, I can just do that. Voila. 
there's my Cindy demo. It's imported it, right? Everything's there, all 33 cards, perfectly loaded, but it's telling me all these images are missing, right? So I click on the artwork and there it gets listing all the images that are missing. So I pop over here, grab the file names, and I just um, come back to here, drop them in, and it's going to upload those, okay? That's going to take a minute to process. So I'm just, while that's working, I'm just going to pop over to the box art, and I'm going to choose um, from here the back of what, the back of card. Where's it called? Show it back, okay? Box front. Box back, upload those. That's going to take a few seconds to process that. Okay, I just need to pick the box color. Oops. It's going to spot. I'll just pick a white box that so fits in nice. There you go. Um, that will take a little minute to process. It's just, let me just reload that. It's going to reprocess the artwork. There we go. There we go. So it's correctly processed uh, the box art with the, color, the side color that I chose. It's loaded the back of the image. You've got that there. Let's now jump back to close that off. Let's jump back to here. And here is all of our artwork is loaded. We can look at the, uh, look at the cards. We can look at the side, this is the images of all of the artwork. And there it is. It's really that simple to load it. You've seen what the deck looks like in Deckable, and that's the process. Very, very simple.